Hey there, friends and enemies, Joper here again, and we got a brand new trailer for Seelie, the first five-star character available on the very first banner for Honkai Star Rail. This is a character I'm very excited about. I think she's going to be excellent, and I just cannot wait to check this game out finally this week, get hands-on, and see if this is as good as Genshin Impact was when it first launched, for example. It was a game that absolutely changed my experience with gaming, so I'm excited to see where this heads, and let's jump into the trailer, and I'm going to give my thoughts by the way i'm dumping all of my wishes into this very first banner for sure you get a lot make sure you pre-register if you haven't already because you'll get a lot of free wishes making trouble on wildfire's territory you guys got a lot of nerve oh yeah she's fire what Yeah, this is sick. Sometimes a sharp blade is the only way to get people to come to their senses. Did I ask for your help? Looks like you could use it. Who is that character? She looks awesome too. Don't tell me what to do. What? That's a sick team. Stop holding me back, Overworlder. Oh yeah, she's lit. Oh my god. Yo, Hoyoverse does such a great job with these trailers. It's insane to me. But this character is fantastic. The other character is one I've heard talk about on like twitter and stuff before i actually watch this trailer i don't know who she is i haven't paid attention to a lot so far i want to go in relatively blind besides the trailers for this game so i'm definitely going to learn about all these characters going forward i'm excited about getting hands on with this game i'm probably going to react to a lot more of the character trailers as well so let me know in the comments down below what type of content you'd like to see me covered for Honkai Star Rail, it's a game that, like with Genshin, I did like everything from character displays, team compositions, all that kind of stuff. And I really want to dive into that more with Honkai Star Rail. Now, be aware that I'm actually not going to wail on this game at all. I am planning to strictly be either free to play or battle pass only, depending on how that works out with this game. I haven't looked into it yet, but. Essentially, I am going to cover things as as, a, as basically a free-to-play player and give my thoughts on the game from that perspective. Because Genshin was a game that uh, I did buy some wishes and stuff like that from time to time, but it wasn't one that I ever wailed on and I was able to beat everything in the game. I didn't really have ever feel like i was held back because i wasn't a whale although i wasn't like crazy overpowered but i think it's more related to, relatable to the common player's experience so that's why i want to stick to that with honkai star rail so let me know if you want to see me cover the story the um characters i'm gonna do uh my pulls i'll do all of that into a video as well but overall i'm excited about this game finally something fresh uh, as a day one genshin player it feels good to have this excitement back that has been missing for some time with that game uh besides the story and the new locations and then uh dendro was really cool this is something completely different that I'm really hyped to jump into. And uh, as a longtime JRPG player, the team turn-based combat is something I'm very familiar with, and it might be right up my alley as well. So I'm really looking forward to that. Yeah, this week we get Honkai Star Rail for real. I can't wait to jump in. Let me know if you guys are excited about this game, if it's on your radar, if it's one you'll be playing for sure. Uh, it looks gorgeous. It, it looks like it's going to have some insane characters. I am absolutely stoked for it. My name is Jopa. Let me know if you're wishing on that first banner as well. I'd love to hear from you guys. I hope you have a good one, and I'll catch you all later.